Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about a free app called Hide from Uninstall List, and this will allow you to um, hide programs from the uh, programs and features and from the Windows app settings so people can't see them to uninstall them. So let's say you have something, a program on there, you don't want the kids to be able to see that you're, you know, tracking their internet usage or doing a key log or something like that, and you don't want them to be able to uninstall it, you could just use this program. So once you download the zip file and then you extract it and you just run the hide ul.exe file here, and then you'll see your list here. Anything that's checked is uh, shown. So here we got 7-Zip, uh, Acrobat, AnyView, 7-Zip, Acrobat, AnyViewer, and then same here, just like that. So let's say we want to hide this uh, CPU ID. Just click the box. And then you can see it just disappeared from Programs and Features. But for uh, the Windows settings, you need to usually need to go back into it. So out and in. Now it's gone. So now if we want it back, check the box. It's back there. Go back in here. And there it is. So as you can see here, the ones that are unchecked are usually unchecked by default uh, by Windows. But you could actually use this program to show them. So let's say the 64-bit HP CIO components. Check that. And now you can see it's there when it wasn't there before. So it's kind of cool if you ever need to remove some of these things that are kind of hidden by Windows. All right, so I'll put a link in the description. You could download it yourself. Nothing, like I said, nothing to install. Just run the executable, and you could hide your programs. But I would make sure you keep a copy of this app handy because if you... Uh, uncheck something and remove it, then you want to put it back in the list, you're going to have to find another way to uninstall it. You know, probably have to go to the program's installation directory and find the uninstaller from there. So, like I said, just keep it handy in case you need to revert back. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.